Welcome to Gaia Yoga, my friends. My name is Christina, and today I offer your yoga routine you can do in the morning as you wake up. Even if you're still in your bed, you can do this routine. So, as you wake up, stretch your legs and roll to your back if you're not on your back and take a moment to connect to your body and observe how it feels. You can stretch the toes and you can stretch your arms overhead, lengthen through your spine, through both sides of the body. And now bend the knees, bring the knees in towards the chest and hug the knees towards the ribs, towards the sides of the ribs. You can play with pointing and flexing your feet, rolling the ankles, waking up your feet, the toes. You can lower the feet down, keeping your knees bent, and you can give yourself a big, big, big hug, welcoming you, your body, your mind, and your heart to a new beautiful day. saying good morning to yourself. And today you're going to have the best day of your life. Inhale and exhale, release your hug and bring your right knee in towards the chest. Squeeze the thigh in towards the side ribs and extend the left leg, stretch your Left leg, point the toes to the front of the room. Send the right knee to the back of the room. Inhale and exhale, switch. Extend your right leg and squeeze the left thigh in towards the side ribs. Point the right toes and direct left knee to the back of the room. And let's do a couple of switches from side to side. One two, three, and four. And from here, bend your right knee, bring your left ankle on top of the right thigh and send the left knee to the front of the room. Observe what's happening in your outer left hip. And now lift the right foot and start bringing your right thigh in towards the chest as you send the left knee to the front of the room. You can bring the palms towards your right hamstring and apply some strength to bring the thigh closer and closer towards the chest. Inhale and exhale, release the hold on your thigh, lower your right foot down and begin sending the right knee to the right side of the room. So you're dropping your right thigh to the floor completely. The left ankle stays on top of the thigh and you're sending the left knee to the front of the room. Observe the sensations in your inner right thigh, the front of your hips, observe and breathe into the tight areas. Inhale, lift your knees back up. And now bring your left thigh on top of the right. If you wish, you can curl your lower left leg at the back of your right leg and lower both knees towards the right side. Maybe they can touch the floor. Finding your twist, you can extend the arms and gaze to the left, trying to keep your left shoulder on the mat. From here, gaze to the right and uncross your lower legs. So find uh, your left leg on top of the right and slowly begin extending your left leg to the right. Maybe you can grab the toes, the ankle, the shin, and begin rotating the chest back to the front, lowering your left shoulder down and gazing to the left side. 
observing the sensations in your outer left hip, your IT band, your glute, your waist. Inhale and exhale, bend the left knee, release the hold, and from here, straighten your right leg, extend your right arm out and direct it to the back of the room and roll towards the right side, finding your armpit on the mat and place your left foot to the floor. Bend in your right elbow, bring in the palm right under the ear, flex your right foot and pass your right leg up. One, two, three, four, five. Try to keep your left foot on the mat and slowly lower your right leg down, extending your right arm, extending your left leg and rolling to your belly. Take a moment to relax. Now bring the palms next to the ribs, draw the elbows back and towards one another, press the feet into the mat and begin lifting through the heart, finding your cobra stretching the front of your body. And exhale down. Inhale up. And exhale down. Inhale, rise up to your elbows and cross your arms. Right arm is at the front of the left and slide the palms to opposite directions, sinking into your shoulder stretch. Observe the sensations. You can gently begin tucking the chin in towards the chest, stretching the back of your neck. Inhale, press through the elbows into the mat and lift the shoulders higher off the mat and slowly uncrossing the arms and bring the palms to the floor next to the ribs, draw the elbows back and find your cobra, lift through the heart and maybe you can extend the arms a little more, draw the ribs to the front and your shoulders back, exhale, lower down. And slowly extend your left arm out to the side and begin rotating the chest to the right, stepping your right foot behind you, opening the heart, stretching your chest and shoulder. Inhale and exhale, lower your right palm back down to the floor. You can circle your left arm all the way to the front, finding yourself on the side and now bending the knees, finding yourself in your fetal position on the right. And from here, begin extending your arms to the sides and finding your twist, lowering your right shoulder to the floor. And observe where you feel the stretch. You should feel it more in the upper back. Inhale and exhale slowly, begin lifting the knees, lowering your right hip to the mat, bring the knees in, relax your lower back, lower the feet down, and now bring your right ankle on top of the left thigh, send the right knee to the front of the room, flex the foot, observe how your hips feel today and begin lifting your left foot and reaching the left thigh towards the belly, towards the chest and sending the right knee to the front of the room. Gently applying some strength to pull your thigh closer and closer towards the chest. Inhale and exhale, lowering your left foot down and slowly begin directing the left knee to the floor, lowering your lower left leg on the mat, thigh on the mat, keeping your ankle on top of the thigh and send the right knee to the front away from you. Feel a nice stretch here at the front of the hip, maybe your groin, your inner thighs, 
Maybe a quadriceps. Just breathe and observe the sensations. Try to relax. Not resisting the stretch. Breathe. Inhale and exhale, slowly begin lifting the knees back up, bringing your right thigh on top of the left and maybe crossing your bottom legs too. And slowly sending the knees all the way to the left and twisting to the right, trying to lower your right shoulder down. Breathe, observe the sensations in your lower back. Inhale, lift the knees and uncross your lower legs with your right leg on top of the left and slowly begin extending your right leg, holding onto the shin, the calf muscle, the ankle, the foot, the toes, whatever works for you this morning. Observing where you feel the stretch, where you feel the sensations. Inhale and exhale, slowly let go of the hold on the foot, bending the knee and lowering the foot to the outside of your left thigh as you straighten the left leg. And slowly rolling to your left side, stretching the left arm to the front of the room. And lifting up, bending the left elbow, bringing the palm under the head. Rooting the right foot into the mat and now lift your left leg higher up towards the ceiling for one, two, three, four, and five. Inhale and exhale, lower your left leg down, extend your right leg and slowly roll towards the belly. Relax here for a moment. Inhale, and when you're ready, crossing the arms, sending your left arm at the front and right arm under the left, stretching the shoulders. Lift through the heart and start sliding the palms away, stretching the shoulders, observing the sensations. You can gently curl the chin in towards the chest, stretching the back of your neck. Inhale. When you're ready, engage your arms. Press the forearms, the elbows into the mat to lift the um, armpits higher and slowly. Uncross the arms and extend your right arm out to the side and begin rotating the chest to the left, lifting your left leg and crossing it over the right and stretching your chest and your shoulder. If you wish, you can lift your left arm and send it back. Inhale, exhale, lower your left palm down, slowly return back to neutral, releasing your left arm, bringing the palms into the mat next to the ribs, draw your shoulders back and down, and begin lifting through the heart, finding your cobra, roll the biceps out, send your shoulders back and down, you can bend the knees, and as you fold down, as you lower down to your belly, lift the thighs off the mat and engage the glutes, engage the hamstrings, and let's pulse them for one, two, three, four, five. Inhale, exhale, extend the legs and lower them down. Roll into your right side for your fetal position. <sighs> Inhale and exhale. Without moving the hips and the knees, begin opening the chest towards the ceiling. You are stretching through your chest to lower your left shoulder down to the floor, finding a nice twist in your middle back. And if the left shoulder cannot touch the floor, that's completely fine. This is where you are. Breathe and enjoy your stretch. Connecting to your breath, connecting to your sensations. Inhale, 
slowly begin lifting the knees back up and descending the left hip down to the floor pressing your lower back into the mat, draw the pubic bone in towards the ribs and feel this engagement in your lower belly. Peel the hips of the mat and slowly begin moving your right hip up. Imagine you're pouring water through the left side and then back to center and through the right. Back to center and through the left, waking up your pelvis. Back to center, right. Back to center, left, back to center, press the palms into the mat, keep drawing the pubic bone in towards the ribs and begin pushing the glutes, the hamstrings up towards the ceiling, stretching the front of your body and tucking the shoulders under, interlacing the fingers as you press the hips, the glutes, the hamstrings up towards the ceiling, push your calf muscles towards the shoulder blades and your chest is beginning to reach towards the chin. Inhale and exhale slowly, unclasp the fingers, release the shoulders, draw the pubic bone in towards the ribs and you can extend the arms up towards the ceiling. You can flex the palms, push the palms into the sky, feel the stretch in between the shoulder blades and begin compressing your spine down into the mat. One vertebra by vertebra at a time. Lowering the arms down and bringing the knees in. Inhale, lift your head, neck and shoulders off the mat. Reach them towards the knees. Feel the engagement in your core and begin rocking forward and back, trying to stay connected towards the knees, massaging your back body. Inhale and exhale, roll to the front and rise up into your squat and slowly rooting the feet into the mat, extend the legs and sit bones up towards the ceiling, taking a moment to stretch your legs here. You can walk your legs, bending the knees one at a time. Now keep your both knees bent. Inhale and exhale, connect to your core, draw the pubic bone in towards the ribs and really slowly begin extending your front body. Send the calf muscles to the back of the room, align the knees over the ankles, hips over the knees, stretch through your belly. Focus on your third eye area. Stretch through your chest, your collarbones, shoulders aligning over the hips and the crown of the head aligning over the spine. And take a moment to observe your balance. Bringing the palms towards the heart center. Remembering to be grateful for everything your new day is going to bring to you. Remembering that anything it throws at you is only to make you stronger and better. Thank you guys for joining me for this quick practice. I hope you feel great and awakened in your body, connected and aware of each and every part of your body. Please share with a friend, subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. Until we practice again, namaste.